think the Cabriana room is probably the best kept secret on campus. It is a room where we have all the artifacts of Francis Cabri, the saint, the patroness of immigrants, uh, the namesake of Cabrini College. We have a lot of her writings that have been translated into English, as well as some of her actual artifacts and items of clothing here. A lot of the documentation here and the collection of artifacts that we're fortunate to have here were brought to us by Sister Ursula Infante, who was the founding president of Cabrini College, as well as Sister Mary Louise Sullivan, who was another president of Cabrini College. They would go to different Cabrini institutions and ask if they could lend their artifacts to us, and uh, they would come here, and it seems like many of them stayed here permanently. For, uh, what we're fortunate to have here are some of Francis Cabrini's dining utensils, Frances Cabrini traveled a great deal, and to make life easier for her, she would be on shipboard for extended periods of time, or she would travel by steam train, and in order to be able to eat with ease, she has a little um, tin collection. It's a cup that screws together, and her eating utensils fit inside that. So you can unscrew that, open it up, her eating utensils are all there, and then the bottom becomes a little candle holder and a drinking cup. We also have a check, because Mother Cabrini is quite savvy. She was an excellent businesswoman. And we have one of the checks that she wrote, because she actually did banking and had a checking account. We have several of her garments that indicate that it was she who these things belonged to. We also have a lot of her naturalization papers, a copy of that, her teaching certificate and um, some information about her travels back and forth. And many, many documents which have been her writing. She was a prolific writer that have been translated from the Italian in which she wrote into English. I think we don't do as a community uh, enough of a job to tell our students about this. Perhaps we could incorporate this into our orientation. Uh, possibly uh, there has been talk that we might be able to create a larger welcome center on campus sometime in the future and these items could be brought out into a more central location that visitors prospective students could see which would enhance the whole history and tradition of the college. I would like students to be aware that when they are a student at Cabrini College they're part of a worldwide enterprise. The sisters are on six continents in 15 countries throughout the world. And even though we're the only college that the sisters sponsor, we're part of this wonderful worldwide network that I think affirms every student's choice of choosing Cabrini College for your higher education experience. Our sisters also provide